Hello, Z-Bird. Today, we're returning to the racetrack in Hot Wheels Unleashed 2 Turbocharged. We played the first game a few years ago when it launched, and now we're back to play the sequel in today's episode of Zebra's Arcade, a series where we try a new game every episode. Let's get started. Whoa, so here we are with our first race. Let's see how this goes. Oh man. So of course this game is all about racing on Hot Wheels tracks with Hot Wheels cars, and this looks amazing. Whoa. I had a lot of fun with the first game when we played it for Zebra's Arcade, so I'm excited to see how this one might feel a little bit different. So let's hop right into the action. We're riding this cool sort of like Mustang kind of car. Whoa, there's like monster trucks and motorcycles now too. Starts. Press the accelerator before no the number two appears to get a boost. All right, so let's see if we can do it. Oh. Not too bad. We'll have to see how things go as we try to race the rest of the competition here. We got the slipstream and ooh, drifting. Use drift to get a boost charge. All right. So I just want to do this right here. Whoa, whoa, no, a little too much, a little too much. Got to get used to it for sure, but this is so cool. It's like a Hot Wheels track in someone's backyard. We got a huge loop coming up. All right, I'm ready for it. Boost. Use boost to overtake your opponents. All right, so I'll use one of these. Get through this super fast. Oh, I missed another one of the little panels there. We'll try if we try to hit this one. There we go. So we can see the meter of it on the bottom. Okay, got it. And then really pull this one over. There we go. And it seems like we have a lead on the competition for the time being, which is good. Of course, it's our first race. So jump, jump to avoid obstacles. Press triangle. All right, ready and go for it through the flaming ring. Whoa. All right, we really have some major speed now. I'm into the wall a little bit though. There we go, there we go. Boost you this corner. We're getting even more just by being on these little panels. Whoa, the spider! Oh, we're stuck! Oh man, okay, we got through. <laughs> Not too bad. So there are different, I guess, like uh, obstacles and stuff like that we gotta be careful of. All right, let's keep it moving then. And uh, Air control, you control your vehicle while in the air by just like steering around. That's cool. All right, let's go for it. So as we boost through here, whoa! Oh no, oh no! <laughs> I, I flipped around a little too much. Uh oh, so we're just down here now, we gotta respawn. Got it, okay. Now I got a little bit to catch up to. So let's try like a front flip or something. Uh, Didn't quite work. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> jeez. Okay, so we don't wanna go too crazy with the tricks, I guess. All right, let's see if we can't get back up to them because now I'm all the way back in 12th place. It's still the first lap though. Dash, try to hit your opponents with the dash. Warning, it depletes the boost charge. Okay, I think we can handle that if we just drift through here a little bit. We're catching them to all these cars and, oh, I see. We go like this and boom, to, to our side. Okay, end the first lap, win the race. So, boom, that sort of worked. There we go, yeah, you can just push them around a little bit. We are now in second place, we're catching up to the competition. Need to race through the rest of these laps. I think we can handle it. All right, so let's get over here. Get that charge. And then boost through. All right. Okay, I'm gonna try to drift through all this stuff. It's so cool that we're in like a backyard though. There's so many like environmental details I'm picking up on as we race through. Here we go, here we go. Jumping through that, and uh, it looks like our car got like burn up a little bit or something. Okay, another turn here. So we're still in the second lap. Oh, okay, here comes the spider. Oh, I tried to avoid the web. I ran right into it. All right, that's fine. And is there any way to look behind us? Oh, here we go. A lot of the crowd is pretty far back there, so as long as we don't make any mistakes with this jump this time, maybe we can make it. Here we go, big speed boost there, and, ooh, I'm scared. Okay, I sorta made it. Uh, yeah, there we go, much better, cool. Okay, can jump over that little barricade there, and then drift through this, come on. It's hard to get a good drift, definitely take some practice. But there we go, the second lap is all finished up. We have one more left to go. So let's give it everything we got here. Oh, the music's really picking up too. Okay, 
Just want to get through here. All right. Uh, got it. Let's get ready for the loop. Getting a lot of boost through all of this. Not bad, not bad. Major speed now. Then I'll just drift through this turn a little bit. We slowed down a lot on our drifts. I wonder why. Hmm. Okay. Go, 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 go. And then jump through this. Oh no, I didn't have enough boost for the jump. Uh, let's try that again. I guess I need boost to jump. Is that how that works? Yeah, I guess so. Good to know, good to know. All right, we're zooming through this pretty well. Just gonna go over this way now. Oh no. All right. Let's watch out for the spider this time. I see the web. Ah, we made it through. Awesome. These laps are pretty long though. The tracks are pretty huge, so. I'm glad that we're ahead of the competition. We might want to step up the difficulty next round. So can I make a cool jump happen this time? There we go. Whoa, that was a really good one. So we're learning as we go along for sure. I'll go past the barricade like that. Drift through this. That was okay, I guess. Come on, here's the finish line and boom, we win our first race here in Hot Wheels Unleashed 2. All right, first place, rev the engines. Look at us, up here on the podium, sorta. We beat these other cars out, no problem. All right, so with that, I guess we can move on a little bit. We got our race results here, our total drift distance and everything. Nice, so are you sure you want to restart the current session? No, I think we would just wanna leave here, right? Or, oh no, I see, uh, we go down here, got it. So there we go, we got a rookie trophy, level one worth of experience. Nice, and for that we get coins, a spin token, and some skill points. Awesome. So from the main menu, you can plunge into the Hot Wheels Creature Rampage, build your tracks, and access all the game's modes. Have fun. Cross-platform features are available, which is cool, but I don't have to worry about it too much. So we have the Hot Wheels Creatures Rampage, as well as quick modes, online multiplayer. Interesting. I guess I'll start with the Creature Rampage? I don't know what this is. Whoa. Interesting. So we got a little Hot Wheels garage here. You're finally here. Why did it take so long? I called you. Six minutes ago, Professor. And we were at the other end of the city. This is our new record, by the way. What's up? Why'd you make us rush here? Uh, it's a little embarrassing. Oh, come on, spit it out. I've got a new device that copies any small items and makes them big and possibly the opposite too. I've tested it on some special track pieces. Five of them, before understanding it wasn't broken, it just uh, needed a little more time. 10 seconds to be precise. No, don't tell me. Wait, what? I'm afraid I've unleashed five creatures. They made some horrible noises and Whoa. have escaped. Oh, you finally arrived, folks. Why did it take so long? Here you come. We arrived five minutes ago. I'm detecting a 74% chance you're being sarcastic. Can you confirm? That would improve my future performance. Oh, did you accept my cookie policy, by the way? Professor, this is way worse than the living rooms. Way worse. Calm, calm. I already have an idea. To worsen the situation, can you fix it? Well, technically, I would need your help to implement my clever plan. Okay, as usual, you got something, but we need to get our hands dirty. No problem, we're the Hot Wheels racing team. Okay, you could wait to fight the creatures as giants, or... That's a bad idea. Professor, hurry! In case you didn't notice, the clock is ticking. They could be anywhere doing serious damage. Or fight them toy-sized. Use the Shrinkatron to beam them small again, and beam yourselves too. What? Why fight if you can shrink them? Um, while magnification is a stable process, shrinking isn't. So it would last a very short time. What looks like a drawback is a guarantee. You'll eventually be back to normal size. If you don't get smashed while scaled down, obviously. Like, no. It's, um, absolutely safe. The device is portable, easy to operate, and it... Didn't I already say no? Robert, this could be the only way. 
I'm not getting miniatured anytime soon. But... But... You could drive all the Hot Wheels you want while fighting. Wait, what? All of them. All! I need to warn you, there's a 0.001% chance that the shrinking process... Nah, shush! I don't even want to know. Darla, I'm in. Alright, we're going. Fine. Professor, activate the Shrinkatron. The Shrinkatron! Find that thing on us now. There is a 99% probability of... Having fun! Go! Alright! We're getting shrinked down to the size of a Hot Wheel car. That's cool. So, our first one here is the beginning. Spinning Goth. Completion requirements. We need to reach the podium and reach first place. Let's give it a go. So we get to choose our different cars here. We have the Roger Dodger here, as well as like the Power Pro. Oh, I like that car a lot. The HW Prototype 12, the Race Ace Monster Truck. The uh, There's a lot of stuff here. There's even motorcycles and some different ones around here. So I think we'll go with this Power Pro, part of the mystery models. There's different variants too, but I don't know if I have any. Okay, cool. Let's keep it going. So we're heading to the mini golf course. Oh, this looks cool. All right, pretty cool environment here. Let's get started with our race. So it's interesting that we had those characters there, but we don't really get to see them in the cars. It's just Hot Wheels racing. Let's go to it, or get to it. So let's see if we can keep up with them this time. We were able to win the tutorial race, but I'm sure things will pick up a little bit from here. Going against the ATV here, get a little bit past it. This car already feels a whole lot faster than the other one, so that's good. But maybe not too much drifting available with it. I guess. Okay, gonna go through here, boost through like that. That was really nice. And whoa, watch out for the golf balls. <laughs> cool. All right, going through this way. I like how there's parts that aren't just Hot Wheels tracks. I think those are my favorite parts. This one is actually like part of the environment and stuff. Okay, let's go ahead and boost through this one, grab that stuff, and this is a tight turn. We gotta get over here fast. Ooh, we're moving, and with a full boost bar, I think we're good just to really get through this. We're done with the first lap already. Watch out for the wall. The music's picking up too. Got this turn again. There we go. So I think this uh, golf course is sort of like Wild West themed. It's like saloons in the background and stuff. Okay, whoa. But so far, this seems pretty ex expected. If you enjoyed the first game, you enjoy Hot Wheels and racing, I think you're gonna like this one too. But it looks like we're really ahead of the competition. All right, yeah, there's a gold mine in the distance. Whoa. There we go, that was great, actually. Gonna go through the loop now. More speed boost coming in. As we finish up the, uh, the second lap. So we're on to the final one. Let's see what we can do to stay ahead, but with a car this fast, I, th I don't think we'll have an issue. Okay. Drifting through that just a little bit. The car really doesn't drift very much. Got it, got it. Grab that one. Ooh, good turn there. I like the feeling of that one. Ooh, come on. That was really good. I'm getting the hang of this. Played a lot. A little bit more, just through this way. All right, here we go. Picking up the speed. Through this final loop to loop. I think we have a couple more turns left and we should be done this race. Here we go, not even, it's right here. Awesome, so we win our first race with the little story mode we have here. Not bad. And we get first place at the spinning golf. Couldn't even see the competition behind us. That's how well we did, so that's really good to see. Uh, we'll keep it moving, and I guess just continue on. But we got big game and first step. Awesome. And well begun. Trophy earned, 500 more experience, which almost gets us to level two. Mission complete, trophy earned as well, and we're back out here. All right, so with that all finished up, we have obtained, we have, we have obtained coins and experience, and that should get us to level two. Nice. Some more coins, a skill point, and a background. Okay, 
So what do we use skill points for? I'm sure we'll figure it out sooner or later, but right up here we have another race for us. Before we do it, I wouldn't mind stepping up the difficulty, I guess it was on easy before. Let's put it to medium and see if that's any better. Uh, ready, set, go, the prehistoric roar. We need to reach first place yet again. And this time we'll use another car. We have the Hot Wheels Prototype 12. Looks really good. All right, so this one is like a cool dinosaur museum. I like it. Cool views for all these tracks so far. I like all the themings to them. There's a lot to enjoy. All right. Are we ready? I think I got the good timing there. Uh, sorta, of, kind of. We're gonna get a slipstream by hanging up behind some opponents. Now I definitely feel like they're gonna be keeping up with us a bit better since we jumped up that difficulty. But we'll have to wait and see. I still think we can pull out a win here. Watch out for the barricade. And then, big drift while boosting. Seems like the best idea. Okay. Whoa, 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 here we go. Speed boost through that. Oh, right, right into the barricade. Not what I wanted. And they are definitely trying to keep up with me a whole lot more now. Which, you know what, I enjoy that. A good competition is always better than just racing by myself, right? All right, let's get through here. Definitely, yeah, grab some of those. Through the dinosaur mouth, but oh, I went into the flag. Oh no, let's respawn real quick. Now I'm really behind. Super unfortunate, but that was so cool. Through the dino jaws. Oh boy. All right, we got a couple people to catch up to, but it shouldn't be too bad. This is definitely a tight turn. Ooh. Oh, I missed a speed boost. Darn, we're slipstreaming now, which just means we're hanging out behind them. Can earn up a lot of points, but with everybody in the way, it makes a bit of a cluster. We're in the second lap now, and I am sort of catching up a little bit. There we go. Ooh, let me grab some of this and some of that and get back to drifting. Not bad, not bad. Okay, that was pretty good. We're back to sort of building up a lead, but any mistake is gonna have them catching up to us, no problem. So we need to be really careful. All right. I don't have too much of a boost at the moment, but if I drift a little bit like that, there we go. Get the super jump through the mouth of the dinosaur. Trying to chomp down on us. Not gonna let that happen. We're too fast for that. Okay, huge drift again. Not too bad. Get this boost. We are coming up on the end of the second lap, I think. Yeah, there's the finish line. All right, here I go. Getting a lot from that, but I went into the sign again. Darn. Here's this final lap. So as long as we don't make any major mistakes here, we should be okay. They are still pretty close behind me. Okay. Got it, sort of. Ah, oh, still bumping into the walls. <laughs> Gotta get used to each car that I try, I guess. All right. Drifted a little bit there. Oh no, come on, come on. Three out of three for laps here. So we just really gotta make things work. Whoa, that was a mistake. I was hoping I could do a cool trick. Oh geez, those are tough to do. I gotta sort of figure that out. So maybe not worth risking on the last lap, uh, but I still might be able to do something here. I don't know, it's gonna be really close. Ooh. Can we do it, can we do it with the big drift here? Oh, come on, out of the way, out of the way. Oh, they're bumping me. Not good. This is my chance to catch up right here. Out of the way, out of the way, here we go. Boom, we got it. All right, a close one. Not anything else, I made it a little more intense for us. The prehistoric roar is completed with another first place finish. Awesome. So there we go, We're able to get some other little achievements down there too, so let's continue on. And we get 500 experience again, nice. I'm really enjoying this so far. So what do we got over for this next mission? We've obtained some coins and experience. Not quite enough to get the level three, but soon enough, I'm sure. All right, you deserved it. Reward, okay, so it's just for getting as far as we have? Not bad. 
So we obtained 250 coins, 175 experience, that will get us to level three, where we get even more coins, skill points, plenty of other stuff. Put yourself to the test, the obstacle race. Whoa, it's in, our, in an arcade. We need to be one minute and 34 seconds, or one minute and 29.5 seconds. So we have sort of two challenges here. Let's hope we can get both done. All this action is not good for my hair. See how it looks dry? So creatures are ravaging the city and your problem is dry hair? Easy for you to say. Try to focus on me for a moment. Hmm, I could try to adapt a formula I have to. No, we don't need another living ooze, not now. Ah, uh, humans. So resourceful and so problematic. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> All right, well, well, they're arguing a little bit. Let's go ahead and try another car here. I wanna try the monster truck, because this thing looks so cool. The race is, is huge. And we'll be trying this out at the uh, arcade room. Oh boy. I don't know if this will be the fastest car for what we're trying to do, but I'll give it one go and see if we can't make it through this trial. This is such a cool environment, though. All right, here we go. So, jump. Remember to use the jump to dodge the obstacles. All right. Oh, I think I got the boost there. Seems like it. So this kind of car has like a different kind of boost. As you can see, it has the little uh, symbols on the bottom instead of it just being a bar. I'll do what I can here. We're really boosting through quite a lot. Jump over that stuff. Huge drift over here. Wow, the monster truck really moves faster than I thought. The thing is, it just doesn't have very good turning. Wow, was there like a shortcut over there? I think there was. Maybe I could take a different path. I took that turn a little tighter. Going by the arcade machines now. All right, drifting through this, sort of, and then onto the actual arcade machines. Whoa. That's cool, we're gonna get a new high score. All right, and then with this turn. Got it. That wasn't so bad. Jump over that stuff. Ooh, that was almost a problem. Okay, here we go, here we go. I'm out of boost for a bit. We'll pick up some here. Here we go. Huge jump. And we're going inside one of the arcade machines here. Whoa, so cool. And we're almost there. I don't know if we're gonna get the best time, but I'm really trying. Okay, big drift over this way. Ooh, hitting the wall a little bit isn't so helpful. We gotta be getting close. I sure hope so. Okay, drifting through here. There's the finish line, come on, come on. Oh, I don't know if I did both of the requirements, but I got at least one of them as we tumble across. All right, did we do it? Guess we gotta wait and see. We got one, not the other, but it was so, so close. Pretty good for a monster truck, I think. All right, we're back out here. And you know, it's one of them. You obtained coins and a skill point. And we can keep moving to this next thing over here, the tropical race first refueling. And I think I'll choose a different car this time, of course. We'll try the ATV. Nice. All right, let's get going. And with this one, cool views. We're at the diner, I think it was. I really like all the different environments so far. I feel like there wasn't as many in the previous game, so that's a definitely a good upgrade. Right, elimination, stay ahead of the others and avoid elimination. So I guess each lap, a couple of the back players will be eliminated. So it's really good to stay ahead of everything as much as we can. So I'll boost through already. Try to get a good drift here. That wasn't so bad. Whoa, we're gonna jump there. Good thing we had enough boost, I didn't for that one. Whoops, my bad, okay. Come on, come on, got it. I think that's it, much better. So now I really gotta move it or we'll face elimination. So let's just try to catch up in 10 seconds. Some of these players are gonna be eliminated. Oh no, boosting through, boosting through. Okay, huge drift through here. Now we got it. Only one player knocked out that time, 11 remaining players. So as long as we're not in last place. That seems good. Ooh. We're in second place for the time being. We gotta keep moving. Whoa, whoa, so that just makes it so I, it jumps for me. 
All right, all right. Keep it going, keep it going. Got it. I sort of missed both, both of the boosts there, unfortunately, but here we go, we get through another one. 10 remaining players. So is it really gonna go through every single player? So, so we might be here a while. All right, come on. Could've been a bit better. Five seconds left. I'm ahead of the, most of the group. Okay. So two of them knocked out that time. Eight remaining players. Yeah, it's definitely getting more intense. All right, the 10 second timer starts again. I'm building a bit of a lead on them, so maybe we'll be fine where we are. Got it. Two more knocked out, six remaining players. Ooh. Huge drift there. Okay, come on. We're still ahead of them all. I need to keep it this way. Whoa, that was a good one. All right. So we're at like the top four placement here. Only one player gonna be eliminated now. I just gotta make sure, whoa, not good. Not good, I'm getting knocked over at the worst time. I'm in the elimination seat right now. We gotta move it. Okay, whoa. So only one player will persist here. If we stay in front like this, we'll be okay. Come on, come on, drift again, boost. 10 seconds, I need to survive up here. Come on. I think we got it, I think we got it. There we go, awesome. So we are able to win our elimination race. Not bad. All right, glad to see it. And we got both of these. Reach first place and eliminate opponents and reach the podium. Cool. And we got Globetrotter as a trophy earned. Bunch more experience there. And we're gonna move back. So with that done, it looks like we might have another level opened up. We attained some coins and experience. Still not quite level four, but if we move over here, you're part of the loot. All right, so I guess we just got rewards here. I like the environment here. The map looks really cool. We got two skill points and an upgrade kit. And then down at this way, we have Sunny Drive. Trails on the ground. Complete your requirements, reach the podium, and reach first place. Let's do this one, and then maybe we'll take a look at the shop. All right, so which vehicle this time? I wanna try a motorcycle for sure, the street stealth. All right, so we're back to the backyard. I enjoyed this area before, so I don't mind doing it again. And it looks like we have a different path throughout it than we did last time. So even when there's different or the same environments, we might still have technically a different track. Ooh, the motorcycle is cool. All right. I'm ready for it. So this one doesn't have as many of the boost symbols, but I think it might have a better base speed or something like that. We'll have to wait and see. Oh, this one. Whoa, we're sliding way too far. Maybe the off-road on this thing isn't the best. So cool, though. I'm pushing that player out of the way. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not what I wanted. So you gotta be careful at spots like that. That is for sure. We're gonna try to do a cool wheelie here as we catch up to the rest of the competition. They are pretty far ahead. Here's a checkpoint, though. Oh, man. Oh, man. I can sort of checkpoint miss. Really? Oh no, I didn't even see that one. I was gonna say maybe we could like find a shortcut like that, but I guess not. That is, oh no, no, come on. <laughs> I'm missing all of these all over the place. That is not good. It is definitely a lot harder to control the motorcycle so far. But we can boost over here quite a bit. Uh oh, watch out for the rock, are you kidding me? Yikes, that's not good. Very dangerous around here, but we got a tight turn coming up, so we gotta be ready for it. Just like that, awesome. So really knowing where the checkpoints are, what just happened? I don't know why I just flew to the side like that. I don't know if I like the bike too much so far. It just feels very easy to get knocked out by just like a gust of wind. And we're only in 11th place, we're so far behind. It's gonna take a lot of work to catch up. But luckily, we're still just now finishing the first lap, so hopefully that means you know there's plenty of time in this race. Just to catch up, we are really moving with this one, though. That is huge. Okay, so what really matters for these turns is that we just make it to the next checkpoint. If I can sort of spot out where those are, we should be fine. See, I, I see a checkpoint right up here. 
So what we can do is hit this one and then sort of cut across a little bit if we need to. Oh, but I hit the wall, I hit the wall, that's not helpful. Okay, geez. We're sort of catching up to the competition again. All right, here we go. We're behind them a bit more. Gonna drift through this. Got it, got it, got it. I think there's a chance we could still win this. Despite the fact that we've fallen behind so much. If we don't get hit by that, everybody else getting in my way doesn't help out at all. So we're still back in 10th place, but we've caught up significantly. Okay, there we go. Sort of over drifting it, but we can catch up right here. I got a little wobbly, but we can keep going. Drift through this part, sort of. <laughs> Come on, here we go. Here's our chance. Got it, the final lap is here. And now we're in fifth place, so that is a huge catch up for sure. So yeah, I can cut this corner a little bit just like that. And then sort of the same deal here if I needed to, but sort of have to hit it at a specific angle. We're really fighting for the lead now. I'm making it over here. Got it. Okay, turn, slow it down a little. And then yeah, I could technically just do this. I don't know if that's actually any faster, but it's really cool that you do have that option, especially since everybody else slowed around at that turn. Really gives us the opportunity to get ahead here, which I definitely need. As much of a lead as I can build, the better. Okay, gonna get that right there. Not gonna get knocked out by the rock, which is great. And I can just drift through this a little bit. No, 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 no. Oh, see, that's the nightmare situation now. Come on, catch back up. Out of the way, out of the way. And then, boost. No, don't knock me out, don't do it. I'm trying to slipstream a little bit here as we get to the end of this race. I'm gonna do that there, and then this is the best time to do this, just boost, go, go, go! We got it, right at the end, we steal a win. The motorcycle is so hard to ride, but it can be worth it if you can pull it off. Awesome, is that a toaster? All right. So there we go, we get ourselves a first place finish, all of the little achievements here, looking good. And for rewards, we get up to level four, as well as more skill points, a spin token, profile icon, nice. And what about out here, now that we got those two missions done, it looks like we attained coins and experience. So there is another level to jump over to here in a moment, or is this just more rewards? Oh no, okay, it's a level. So before we do that, I wanna take a look at the shop, because we have skill points, we have coins, what can we spend them on? So yeah, it looks like we have a little bit we could get here, whoa. So we could get something like the split image for 2,000. Why not give that a try? So purchase this vehicle, shopping time. We're gonna open up this pack and there it is. So cool. So here's our first card that we've purchased. It's sort of split up in the middle like that. Very cool. And we can customize these cars a little bit too, it seems, or maybe. There doesn't seem to be too much I can customize it with. We can change the sound if we had any. Uh, I could purchase one. Uh, why not? There we go, can I hear it? Oh, okay, that's what it sounds like, good to know. Um, we can change the boost color too, oh, why not? Um, we'll buy a different colored boost, just like that. Now it's pink instead of blue, right? Or yellow, cool, I like it. Uh, is there anything else we can get in the shop? I don't know how to use our skill points or anything just yet. Uh, unleashed missions, complete the unleashed missions to get unique prizes. So we're working our way through some of these and we got some of them. So we've obtained a card background, uh, another background and another background, cool. And we can customize some more stuff. Interesting, so this is like our profile a little bit. Nice, I don't see too much more we can do at the moment in the shop, but I guess with that, we can go to our collection of cars, this is the collection where you can upgrade your vehicles. Go to vehicle management and unlock skills. Oh, okay, where's vehicle management? Uh, for right now, this is just, oh, okay, so I go here. Here you can spend coins, skill points, and upgrading kits to upgrade your vehicle. Spend what you earned and buy a skill, buy a skill and equip it. Oh, I see, so is this for just a specific vehicle? So I should choose that one I like a lot, like the car I just bought. I should purchase, or yeah, I should get some extra stuff for this one. So we have our stock stuff here. I can improve the handling. Increases the handling while drifting, but reduces the boost charge gain while drifting. Um, 
speeds up the gain of boost charge while drifting, but reduces the handling of the drift. Or the vehicle is immune to barriers, tornadoes, webs of the spider ambush module. Oh, that sounds good. I want some immunity, so I just need to use one of our points there, which we had a couple of, so that's not too bad. And then maybe just try out some of these. So can I get all three of them? Oh, I can. How do I upgrade this? I don't quite have enough. I would need both coins and an upgrade slot. So I can come back to that. But uh, what about over here? Increasing the maximum speed? I don't know how to do this one, but it looks like I can't quite reach it yet. So yeah, we're getting there. Not bad. So that was pretty cool. Wait, I got extra gear? How'd I do that? Oh, I see. So can I only have one of these at a time? Yeah, I can remove this one. Oh, I see. So I can only have one at a time. Let's do the obstacles one then, just in case. So we'll be immune to some stuff as we race through. That's great. So let's do at least one more mission today. We got the octopus. Whoa. Beat the boss. That sounds cool. Whoa. We found it. Quick, Darla, activate the shrinkatron. Wow, it works. We'll see how it works on living things instead of toy creatures. We're not just living things. We're your friends. Your big friends. Now my tiny friends. It works. Quick, let's jump into a car and finish this thing once and for all. All right, so we're racing the shrunken down octopus. Let's use our newly upgraded car over here, the Splendid Image 2. All right. Let's go to the golf course and race the octopus. And there it is. That's so cool. So how do we take it down? That's the question. I'm not quite sure. Hit them all. Hit the targets to damage and defeat the boss. Looming rage. Watch out for the rage. Don't let it fill up. I'll try my best. Uh, three, two, one, and go. So let's go ahead and boost through this like that, pick up that token, and that's gonna damage it down a little bit, it seems. Cool, and this car moves fast, whoa. Sort of hitting the wall a little bit, come on. <laughs> there we go. Got it. I'll drift a little earlier this time. There we go, that helps out. Go through the loop, and it's it's rage bar is filling up, or maybe that's just his health. Oh, I missed it. Uh-oh, that's a problem. Oh, we're sort of in danger here. I'm trying to turn. There we go, here we go, here we go, ready? Boom, I think that helped. Still gotta move, still gotta move. Here's the next one coming up. So if I just drive through that one, we're doing pretty well so far. I sort of have to learn the track as we go along here, but it looks like up here, we got another one. That one sort of had different colors to it, interesting. This is a cool section of track. I'm gonna hit this, boom. Ooh, could have been better, could have been worse. All right, going through here, got it! That wasn't so bad, but it really is building up that rage now. Uh, all right, all right, ready, boom! All right, well, I guess it's sort of the first lap. It seems like we have a lot more to go here. We need to hit nine more of them if we want to defeat this octopus. Whoa! Hitting the wall, not good. Got it. Okay, this time I tried to drift a little too early. So if you don't drift early, you sort of just run into the wall the whole time. You can't really move away from it too easily. You don't want to go too early, you're just gonna hit the other wall. There we go, that was a little bit better. All right, now we're moving. And if I could just get over here, come on, before that fills up. I don't know what happens if it fills up, if it's just game over, so I'm just really trying to move it. Here's another one. Come on, got it. Okay, this next part might be a bit of a rush. There it is, got it. And somewhere over here is our next one. I don't quite see it yet. There it is. Oh no, oh wait, got it. Ooh, just barely ran into that one. I was able to use a little push to the side to get it. There it is, there it is. Ready, and one more. Where is it? I don't know. Do we have enough boost to get to it in time? It's right here. Got it. I think we destroyed the boss. You win. Awesome. So there we go. 
destroyed the giant evil octopus, no problem. All right, so with that done, uh, I guess we continue. Uh, once upon a time, we didn't get that one done, but maybe it's just over time we get that. All right, so cool, the octopus trophy earned. And of course, we get to level five with all of our work. Pretty cool. It had eight legs. And zero chances of beating us. Technically, they're tentacles, not legs. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that wraps up our first section here of the story mode, defeating the octopus. And we obtained some extra stuff there, not bad. We're on our way to level six, and what's over here? Tropical Island completed, so we'll get some rewards just for completing that. Uh, whoops, wrong button. Let's go ahead and get those. Awesome. And we're level six now, which will get us even more stuff. So yeah, very cool that we unlocked so much. As you can see, we would head into a new area here now that we can put it the tropical islands. Very, very cool. So this game is really like the previous one quite a lot and the fact that it's just racing with Hot Wheels cars. So if you enjoyed the first one, I'm sure you'll like this one too. And with that being said, I would love to hear, would you like to see more episodes of this? Would you like me to turn it into a full series? But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Zebra's Arcade. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.